I don't know if this is the sort of place to tell real stories or not, but I might as well let you know my current situation. So, the first time I got a phone was five years ago, when I first began high school. It's a Samsung Galaxy Ace, and I've been treasuring this crap since I was like 13. Now, ever since I got this phone, I've been going to a restricted area behind my apartment building with my friends. The restricted area is basically train tracks for cargo trains along with an overpass. Luckily, no security guards pass by, so we've been safe. Under the overpass, there's a few cool graffiti pieces, but one that stands out the most is this number 9674, and it's right in the middle of the left wall of the overpass and written in big, dark, uh, comic sans kind of numbers. So I'm taking pictures of 9674 when I get a call. I didn't bother checking the number, I just canceled on it. After we were done, I left for home and uploaded the pictures onto my computer, and then I went on doing some other thing. Every Friday after school became a train track day. We'd go to the train tracks and just record weird videos of my friends and I sharing jokes, having fun, all that stuff. Except we noticed something on probably our third time going there. There were more 9674s up high on the overpass. Keep in mind that this overpass is literally 11 or 12 meters tall, and above it is a highway for cars. So we started taking more pictures of this. It was the 7th or maybe 8th day, but there were more 9674s, and this time it was all around us. It was written in every way you can think of, different fonts, numerical, even kind of foreign language looking characters. I was taking pictures of all of them, really. I had a whole folder on my phone dedicated to 9674. Anyway, this is the part where I got a really bad feeling in my stomach. I noticed that I was getting continuous calls from this number. Now, please note that the asterisks represent the area code, and I'm not willing to give that out. Asterisk, asterisk, asterisk. One, two, three, nine, six, seven, four. Everything about this number was this fucking terrifying. One, the area code. Two, the most generic set of numbers ever. One, two, three. And, of course, number three, nine, six, seven, four. We knew that there was a guy who'd be coming to the overpass when we wouldn't be there to graffiti on 9674 onto the walls. We also knew that the caller, well, he had to be this guy, but we had to make sure, and probably we did the stupidest thing imaginable. My friend decided to prank call the number. He went with the typical angry Spanish pizza delivery man. A few seconds of the guy breathing through the other line, then came one word. Dylan? It was a computer-generated male voice that said my friend's name. We didn't know what it meant or what it was supposed to be about, but I blocked the number and we decided to just stay away from the overpass. Currently... Well, it was Dylan's birthday just about a month ago, and I've been getting calls again, but I don't want to pay attention to them. Well, I noticed a number. Asterisk, 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 321-9692. I thought about it, and then I noticed something. 96 equals the year. 7 or nine, the month, four, two, the day, those are our birthdays. <laughs>